well uh, in this video i'll be creating the footer area so let's take a look at the footer design and convert it step by step so if i go to my figma file and scroll down here you can see the footer which looks like this now if i go to simply customize and go back to the customizer beginning option so here you can see the footer builder so Astra has this powerful header and footer builder. I really like these features. Here you can see the footer builder. If I click on footer builder, it looks like this. It's completely blank at this moment. Now, if I go to design again, there is a four column. So I'll be creating this four column here. And also I'll be creating the complete footer using the footer builder. Go to customizer again and make this four column i just cl click on this gear icon and here you can see four column now change it to four so the first one is a little bit bigger than the usual column or other three column so if you take a look at the design here you can see the travel with some lorem ipsum text which is a little bit bigger than other column here now if I go to customize, copy the text for, from here first, go to customize, click over here and select widget 1. So if I click widget, got it here and select image because I would like to display my logo here. From media library, select image from here. After that, I would like to add some paragraph. Click over here again, click on paragraph, and paste the text here. Just paste it again. I'm not sure if I have copied it. Okay, just copy the text again from here. Go to customize and paste it here again. It's working. So, it's working right now i'd like to reduce some text from here now as you can see there is a if i hide this one here you can see the logo and text here now if i take a look at other options if i click show now and the next column is useful link so i'm not sure if i'm going to copy this one again or not let's copy let's try and select widget 2 and click over the widget type your list or you can type here let's take a look which is the menu item navigation menu so it will not gonna work so i'd like to use list item here Or there is another option that you can also use which is Astra widget so using Astra widget you will be able to easily add text list item with icon features and some other extra features let's first try list item here special offer contact attractions or gallery So the list item looks like this if i select menu or if i select a link here it looks like this so it looks perfect just copy this one hit enter and paste couple of time go to our design and here you can see contact copy change it to contact and also attractions so i have used a short code uh, or keyboard shortcut features just paste here attractions and our gallery So our gallery I have added here so also add a link here our gallery save now as you can see it looks like this 
if I take a look at the widget, it looks perfect. Now, if I take a look at design right now, there is another heading which is called useful link. Go to customize, click over here and type heading, paste here, useful links and take this heading at the top. Change the heading type to H4 or you can change it to H3 it will be way bigger so h4 should looks perfect now if i hide the control it looks like this so there is a, a space at the bottom and it doesn't looks good and we can fix this later and we will uh, learn how to debug the space uh, how to debug uh, such a things and how to uh, fix them in the future let's go to our design again and take a look the default color is black color if i go to customize click on footer widget design so inside the design and inside general there is a couple of options so if you click on this gear icon which is called general it looks like this and if you click on design it looks like this so here you can change the position easily currently they do not have the options in the free version inside the design to change the color in the footer so i will show you how you can change it later when i will be showing you the astro pro in this tu series tutorial so right now first i would like to use astro free later on i will show you how you can change a few things and additional things how you can add more features using astro pro so stick with this video and hopefully you will be able to learn a lot of things regarding astro let's copy this widget so you can simply copy this widget just click on okay so this one is uh, also not available inside the free version you can copy this widget on the paid version which is the astro pro now click on widget 2 here and we widget, add widget 3 so copy all the elements from here click widget 3 and paste it here find events well so at the fourth one which is follow me on social add social link here type heading heading 3 oh, sorry it's heading 4 follow me on social and add some social icon you can add simply here let's add behance you can add linkedin and align left that's how it looks and it's done now if i click publish let's compare to the bottom footer area and go to design it's also white color let's change change the color just click on this gear icon and go to design here and here you can see the background color is gray color i would like to use pure white color and the above footer which is a little bit uh, gray color it looks good i think so you can also change the color by just clicking on this gear icon click on design and here you can see the background color so you can change it also from here but i'm not going to change it right now now click on publish view the page and reload the page here scroll down a little bit further and here you can see the footer area now in the next part i will be showing you how you can add a custom css inside this uh, footer to make it uh, much similar and more similar to the travel blog website figma file